Greetings fellow humans, I'm Martian Boo, and today I wanted to showcase a mid-range Reno Hunter deck I built specifically to counter combo decks. In Wild right now we have some obnoxious combo decks like Mine Rogue and Quest Mage. It can feel hard at times to be able to interact with these decks without destroying your win rate in other matchups. But despite its reputation as an aggro class, Hunter actually has some of the best tempo oriented anti-combo cards in the game. So if those decks are getting you down, you might be interested in playing this. So this deck does have a mid-range tempo-based game plan. We don't have a specific win condition. We're just trying to get ahead on board and pressure the opponent's life total with just some key value minions that keep us from running out of gas. To handle aggro decks, we have Acid Ma and Dreadscale. Dreadscale deals one damage to all enemies at the end of the turn, and Acid Ma makes it so that whenever an enemy minion takes damage, it's destroyed. So they're great together, but there are a lot of pieces that work well with each of them individually. So you can put Serpent Bloom on Dread Scale. You can use Wound Prey or Kolkar Pack Runner with Acid Maw. There are a lot of nice ways to deal with early aggro boards between these two minions. Felder in the Lost is the fancy new Highlander card for Hunter from Showdown in the Badlands. And it is also fantastic at dealing with aggro decks. You play this on four and it's a one-sided Hellfire that leaves a three four. It's pretty great. We do have a selective breeder package in here. A lot of Hunter players like to go with just three beasts so that you always get the same three options when you play Selective Breeder. And I respect that, but I prefer a tighter package with just the best beasts, so you're always discovering a good beast, but not restricting yourself to just running three in a deck, especially now that we have Acid Maw and Dread Scale. It's just too limiting to keep it to only three. So I do have both of the buzzers in here, Starving Buzzer to interact with Kolkar, Sneaky Snakes, Awakening Tremors, and Wound Prey to draw you some cards, and then Messenger Buzzard, which draws you a beast while also buffing your hand, and since all of your beasts are good, it's always getting you a great card. And then between Beast Stalker Tavish and Reno Lone Ranger, you have a lot of value into the late game. If you need that value to beat control decks and stuff like that, as well as Dino Tamer Bran and Zephyrus the Great to give you burst damage to finish things off. So that's your game plan against regular stuff, specifically against combo. We have Rindling's Rifle and Beast Stalker Tavish. So Rindling's Rifle allows you to get things like pressure pressure plate and snipe that are very, very good against combo decks, but absolutely awful against everything else. So in those matchups, you have access to those secrets that help shut down the combo decks, but in other matchups, like against aggro, you can get explosive trap and help keep them off you. Same goes for Tavish, he's got zombies for mine rogue, he's got explosive trap and motion denied for quest mage, while also being amazing tempo and value in other matchups. I do have the specific anti-combo cards in here, like Dirty Rat and Wild Bloodstinger. These are both really well statted minions that allow you to pull an important minion out of your opponent's hand. While a lot of Reno decks have moved away from Dirty Rat recently, the Acid Ma Dread Scale presence in this deck allows you to circumvent the Dirty Rat downside against decks where you might be pulling a big scary threat and Dirty Rat is less useful. Bloodstinger is just a huge body, so almost everything it pulls dies, and the Bloodstinger actually does survive most of the time as well. One of the funnier ones in here is actually Swamp King Dread, and I know that it says seven in the image, but it has been buffed recently to six. So this is a six mana nine nine that attacks minions your opponent plays as they play them. So if you get this out against Mine Rogue, for example, as you'll see in this video, they try to play the mine so that they can attack with their weapon to deal all of that extra damage, but the mine dies immediately into the Swamp King Dread, limiting its damage to eight. And for a lot of decks like this, it's too hard to remove the Swamp King Dread, so they just can't get it out. So that was an overview of the deck. We're going to get into some gameplay so that you can actually see it in action. But before we do, I want to tell you about this video sponsor, Card Cards and Castles 2. Cards and Castles 2 is the cutest digital card game on the market right now. It's all about getting characters onto the board, defending them with spells, and trying to take out the opponent's castle while defending your own. If you like board-based gameplay where positioning matters, this game is for you because that is what it is all about. And now is the best time to give it a try because they just released Draft Mode. In Draft Mode, you're shown cards in sets of three, you pick which one you think is best and build yourself a deck to play for a specific run. 
You keep playing until you either win seven or lose two and get rewards based on how well you did. This is an awesome way to learn the cards, get used to what's good and what's not while building your collection so you can create something interesting of your own to bring to ladder. Cards and Castles 2 is really sweet and I hope you'll give it a try. Definitely check the link in my description to download the game for free, both on PC and on mobile. And without further ado, let's play some Reno Hunter. Odd hunter, demon hunter. One day I'll be a real knight. Hey, that's your friend. Ancient technology from the before times. What in the spaghetti could cause that considering all the other coins they've shipped? No sound and no gold from what I've heard. Oh really? Well, I do think that this hand is looking pretty good against Chumbus Demon Hunter. I will say that much. Next turn, we'll just go boop, boop, and then win the game. Ow! Owie! Stop! And no! Actually, I kind of want to Acidic Swamp Who's that. Maybe Zeph will be a bro. Maybe Zeph will be a real bro. Uh, sure, fine. Wait, are we running Trinket Tracker with secrets? We are not running secrets and we are running Trinket Tracker. Huh? Huh? You don't know why you thought Tracker tutored a secret? Ah, I see. I desperately want to know the, uh, the pick rate on... Um... By Scenarius. By Scenarius. What the pick rate on... Um, Temple Enforcer is? Yeah, me too. Silence my Reno Jackson, will you? Hmm? I see how it is. Here we go! I will silence. <laughs> 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 we just let them drop our cards! <laughs> uh, gift of Illidan. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let me work my magic. Ah, I was gonna play this. Now I have to play the other one that's also good. What? She got to draw more cards. Mm. The spirit's presence grows strong. The spirit's presence grows strong. Hello. What has the wind brought? They will tell legends of this. They will tell legends of this. Spirits bless you. Oh my. Oh my chat. Peace and patience. Oh yeah, we saw that one. New Raza is gonna be great. Yeah. I'm not going to bring this up again until the next time I bring it up, but um, I'm having a little trouble getting excited about it because like if it's good enough to be fun, it's going to get nerfed. Wow. The gods of the wild are with me. I can't lose in wild. Stay alert, my chungus. New Raza isn't arena requirement as well. I do like, I do think it's kind of funny that it's flip-flopped from last time. 
in standard so uh are you really gonna offer me these over shadow word pain you beef stew damn it Zephyrus you big stinky chungus why are you so bad at this all right anyways um <laughs> so for last time Raza had the Highlander requirement, and the hero card could be played in anything. This time, the hero card has the Highlander requirement, and uh, the Raza can be played in anything. Isn't that funny? I don't have a turn five to play. I was gonna play one of those turn fives. <laughs> Oh, man. But, like, Zephyrus doesn't know that, if that's your point. It's not like Zephyrus is looking into my hand and saying, oh, you need something for next turn. That's not how Zep works. It doesn't know what's in my hand. I'm running extra large Starline Priest, and my only wins are from people scared of Control Priest. Oh, because they're conceding. Non Reno Raza Priest coming to wild format near you. Maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Neat. Mm, I guess. I don't think that's great, but sure. How does he not know he was literally an Andrew? <laughs> Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Disaster for you. I actually don't super want to play this. Am I playing this? <laughs> You're going to run Shutter Block in your bomber deck? That's funny. How dare you? It's going down. I'm yelling timber. I would rather save this for another time. <laughs> the card that fires your hero power twice is gonna be an OTK deck worked out by folks with more brains than you. So let's see. Um, you make your sulfurous hero power, then you, you have that and you have garrison commander out and it deals 32 damage. It's perfect. But really, um, don't you just play with Uther? Sounds like, so, sounds like Uther is more playable than ever. <laughs> Which like, I'm not saying it'll be good, but like, I don't know, that sounds all right. It's like, from a fun perspective at least. Because you have to get to turn nine with Uther is the big problem. But yeah, I'll definitely, I'll definitely play some of that. Sounds sweet. <gasps> this one. Looking for a standoff? Be careful. I'm a tomato. Please don't fireball me three times right to my face. I'm the only one who's allowed to do that. Please, no. Okay. Well, that's not great. Get one of these and play it now. Ah, uh, too bad. Too bad. <laughs> gonna be rich. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. How dare you? How dare you? Alright, it's not looking good, chat. You will find me wherever the action is.
All right. All I have to do is not have copied our Reno Jackson. As long as they got something else, we're good. Prage with me. Don't copy my Reno Jackson with Spyglass. You big beef stew. Ah, ha, ha. ah good. <laughs> Should I keep these two together? Should I keep these two together? This is really good if it's Pirate's Rogue. So I'll do it. And I'll just regret it if um ends up being Mine Rogue. But we'll discover Viper with Selective Breeder, so it'll be fine. Alright. Are you ready for a sick play? Get Viper with Selective Breeder. And then trade it so that there are two Vipers in my deck. So my dupes are off. Who's in? Who wants it? Who thinks that's a good idea? <gasps> Great idea, thank you. All right. How you'll beat Mine Rogue without Sticky? <laughs> Selective Reader. You know what card I want. Don't be Zephyrus. <laughs> it's okay, Rindlings can still offer us Snipe or something. <laughs> Stuff will give Corsair most of the time here. Uh, only if it's fixed. It um, it's been having trouble recognizing three one weapons. All right, let's do that again. These are all terrible. <laughs> All right. I know that they have evasion, but like, I'm not trying to hold off until I, you know, that play lines itself up perfectly. Interesting. <laughs> well, I'm very surprised that secret worked out, but okay. Okay. So this is a 50% shot to hit the mine or hit the whatever. Dread ends it, right? Yeah. Jed changes nothing. Well, they play the mine, and then this kills it. Sigil and mine is a loss. Mine would deal eight damage. Eight damage isn't sixteen damage. Ha <laughs> Dread really did end it. <laughs> well, I kind of want to keep Felder in with Buzzard, even though this isn't a great, um, like this isn't the ideal matchup for that, right? Um, but still. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Even Mr. Boo can't resist value. Mm-hmm. Well, no shot this is Dead Man's Hand, right? That would be too funny. I know that they probably have like gauntlets and stuff that this would be good against. Fine. Fine. That's one of the orders of all time then. <laughs> Unlucky. I don't want to waste my coin yet. But yeah, I should have um I should have drawn first if I wasn't gonna do that. I was just pretty confident. Interesting. Well, now I kind of want to do these two together. Hmm. Mm. 
It's not going to be Gauntlet Warrior like this, right? No shot. You love the opponent's name? It is a good name, isn't it? They announced Overwatch collaborating with Cowboy Bebop. We're one step closer to Hearthstone in One Piece. <laughs> Boo J4, let's go. Hey, Pug, how you doing? Thank you so much for the full year of subs. I appreciate you, my friend. Mm, okay. Is it like Gauntlet Warrior after all? Beep. Boop. I mean, like, it doesn't have to be Gauntlet Warrior to be Skipper Warrior, I guess. I guess. Pug gifting out five subs. Pug, thank you so much, my friend. That's so generous of you. Congratulations, Mirage Kanarski. It's trash, Kendro and Maska, Maska SD. Anyways, yeah, uh, Pug, thank you so much. I appreciate you. <laughs> You're amazing, my friend. Can you boost cam trains? Yep. Yep. Got your skipper. Look at this guy. Look at this beefy, beefaroony, beefus Maximus. Why would you do that? That was my most favorite uh, web web stinker. Blood, blood, bungus. <laughs> I don't think we're allowed to say blood bungus in uh, light company, but I've done it. You would like Overwatch to have one piece skins actually. Chat, I've been playing Fortnite, and uh, apparently I just missed the Frieza skin. I'm so sad about it. Yay! Yay for beefy, beefaronius. I don't love that it hit me in my own face, but um, what can I do? They'll never, they'll never figure out what that secret is. But the Frieza skin is low-key cursed, is it? What's wrong with it? But anyways, it was in December. <laughs> Owie! That hurt my feelings. I really would like like a Lotheb here. Lotheb would be real nice. Oh, yeah, that's nice too, actually. <laughs> Good luck, Herp Harper Sharps. You're now playing Mill Priest with Bunny Stomper. Those are words. Those are some of the words of all time. I brawl all my stuff. All right, Dreads, it's up to you. You have to survive. Aw. Hey, Reno. Should I do my play? My secret play to turn off my dupes? None can stand against the Bongus. Um... Locked and loaded. Good luck. Good luck cracking my carapace. They never crack my carapace. Do try to keep your hey. Fire. Oofers. The threats continue. I'll resist the urge, chat. I'll resist the urge to do it. <laughs> I 
tough or smart? Yep. Only the smorkiest. Thinking about, um, well, I gotta choo choo something. Thinking about doing this just to like not lose, you know what I mean? Like, can we just set up super lethal if I do this? Like, they can't do their skipper stuff if they are under standoff conditions. Viper value? That was Viper value, that's true. <laughs> but yeah, we got to win. Viper is moral support, okay? Except in Mine Rogue when it's like super essential. <laughs> Hearn versus Garrosh. More like Garbosh. Am I right or am I right? Am I right or am I right, chat? Come on. Mm. Oh no. Not even warrior. I actually kind of like the skin a lot. And you know what's nice about it being a hunter skin instead of a druid skin? I don't like instantly change it on three every game by going bio into guff. <laughs> Um, um, um. We'll rat their Odin, it'll be fine. Are you guys excited to make a zombie beast? Can't wait for Zeph to give the funny. <laughs> we did get it. <laughs> Okay. We'll get you back on someone's feet. We'll get you back on someone's feet. These are terrible. These are awful. Wow. It's perfect. Suddenly it's amazing. Alright, sick. Look at my custom zombies. Oh. Your wish is my tomato. How does self damage lifesteal work? Deals the damage, then heals the damage. That's why Ankle Biter was good in Dark Lair. Goodbye, Zephyrus. Bum, bum, bum. Best zombies of all time. <laughs> How could you? How could you do that to me? It's too bad that it doesn't have the plus one plus one. Let's go. Acid Ma. Wombo combo? Bicenarius. Look at this Wombo combo. <laughs> Why is Hero didn't die? True. <laughs> yeah, good question. Good question. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Mm. You'll find me wherever the action is. How dare you? Goodbye, all my stuff, right? No, they weren't expecting to get more armor out of that. Oh, okie dokie. Look at my Hydra's threat. 
Look at its big face. Is there something behind the camera or are you just staring at our souls? I'm staring at your souls. I'm staring deep, deep into your souls. Again. What's up, Mr. Beef Stew? Should have done this first, but whatever. But whatever. See, yeah, that would have been... Eh. I don't know. I'll still take it, but... I'm happy enough with this. <laughs> Look, we get our zombies back, chat. We got it back. We got it back. Because I don't know that I wanted to, like, bring out the Astalor and then do nothing, right? Like, I don't think this was that much better. And by that much better, I mean better at all. Now I get to take care of that Reno style. Whee. Looking for a standoff, be careful, it's against me. Mmm, <laughs> yuck. I'll give that a yuck with a capital Y. Capital Y, did you offer me those? That wasn't a beast. Here we go. <laughs> I admire my opponent playing this out. I would do the same, as hopeless as it seems. Chat, remember when I did three hero cards, Hunter? Remember that video? That deck that was felt surprisingly good. Wasn't that in, like Sunken? I think it was right before Sunken, actually. The deck just kind of magically worked out a little bit. How low could Zul'jin cost now? I feel like I want him at like, you know, at least at eight, but also like make his hero power a little more exciting. <laughs> All right, what you got in there? Okay. I feel like you could have his hero power deal three and cast a random spell. You've cast an enemy, and it would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. Do you have this in a bigger size? I mean, his battle cry could be nutty, so not too low. But the hero power, eh? I mean, like, okay. So with that battle cry, if you had it at like six, would it really be that bad? Cast a bunch of random stuff at random targets, including possibly your own face. In today's wild, I don't know that that would be that bad. Mm, I have thirteen now. They have a million armor. It's not happening. That wasn't what I want you to hit. Dude, we've gotten so much value out of this zombies. This has been a nutty zombies. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> None can stand against our fungus. Okay, mm goodbye. <laughs> like you said, best zombies ever. Yep. Hard carried. I wanna be the very best, like no one ever was. To catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. I will travel across the land, searching far and wide. Teach Pokemon to understand the power that's inside. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. It's you and me. I know it's my destiny. Pokemon, oh, you're my best friend in a world we must defend. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. A heart so true, our courage will pull us through. You teach me and I'll teach you Pokemon, gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all.